mindfulness Monday and it is beginning to feel bad. So we just need a few things today. So if you're gonna go there, you can use a mat or a towel. And you'll just need a water bottle and just some pillows. Um, if you don't have a water bottle, you can go ahead and just grab one. So um, if you have everything, we're just gonna go ahead and come to our mats and we're gonna start in just a crisscross applesauce position. Um, but before, before we go ahead and get started, if you're new to yoga, I just kind of wanted to let you know a little bit about what yoga is. Yoga is just a type of exercise that helps you build strength and mindfulness and teaches you to take deep breaths. And it's just about um, learning how to balance and finding your center and being grounded. Um, so we're gonna go ahead and get started. Um, so just kind of go ahead and come to crisscross applesauce. Put your feet under your legs, your back straight up, and your hands on top of your knees. And we're just gonna take a few deep breaths. Breathe in, and then breathe out slowly. Breathe in, and then breathe out. Breathe in, and then breathe out. And you're just gonna breathe in through your nose and out your mouth one more time. And we're just gonna keep breathing throughout each pose we do. So our next pose we're gonna do is called the butterfly pose. So you're gonna go ahead and take your legs out your feet are going to be at the top of your mat and also your hands are going to be on top of your feet and your legs are going to be up like this a little bit like you're a butterfly. This is where you might need the pillows. Um, you can put a pillow under each leg so like this but if you don't feel like a strain in your legs, you don't have to use them. It's just if you kind of feel like a strain or a pull on your legs that makes you feel uncomfortable. So we're going to go ahead and get into the butterfly pose and just pretend that we're a butterfly and just move your legs up and down. Your hands are going to stay on top of your feet. You're just going to take some deep breaths and just pretend you're going to a place that makes you feel relaxed, whether that's the beach or the mountains or wherever that makes you feel relaxed. Breathe in through your nose and then breathe out through your mouth. Okay, and then slowly open your eyes if your eyes are closed. You can close your eyes throughout this time or you can just leave them open, whichever makes you feel more relaxed. So next we're going to go into the pose that's called star pose. So we're going to actually stand up for star pose. So slowly stand up. Slowly stand up. Your feet and legs are going to come out and your hands are going to come out to your side. When your hands come out to your side, we're going to breathe in. So breathe in and then out and just say that you were a star right here, right now, no matter how you feel your star today. I just want you to let you know that. Um, sometimes we may feel sad or upset. Um, you, are, you are a star right here and right now I just want to let you know that. Um, so just take a deep breath in and say I'm a star. And slowly bring your hands back down and then your legs back together. So now we're gonna go into what's called tree pose. So for tree pose, you can either do two things. You can take your foot and put the back of your foot here, which is called your calf or your knee. So whichever one is easier for you. And we're gonna breathe in when we put our foot beside our calf or knee. And then we're gonna breathe back out and put our hands to our chest and our palms together like this. So let's all, do it all together slowly. Breathe in. And then breathe 
back out. And just hold it for just a second. And then slowly come down and rest your hands back on your legs. And then kind of bring your feet together. And now we're gonna go into what's called the sun pose. So for the sun pose, our hands are gonna come above our head. We're gonna, we're gonna breathe in when we do this. Breathe in. And then out. And then slowly just come back down. And then we're gonna turn to your side. And we're gonna do what's called a child's pose. So we're gonna go back down to your mat for child's pose. So slowly go down to your mat. So we're gonna do, for child's pose, you can do um, two different things. So you might wanna move your water bottle just in case you um, need to. Um, but what you're gonna do is you can either put your hands or your hands on your knees if you want for right now, but your your knees and legs are gonna go as wide as the mat for this one. And then your stomach is gonna go down, your forehead's gonna touch the mat, and your hands and arms are gonna go out in front of you. So that's the first way. Or the next way you can do it is where you're kind of in a ball. So your, your knees are gonna be together, your legs are gonna be together, and your, so your stomach's still gonna come down, and your, your toes are still gonna to touch like this, and your hands are still gonna be out, so you're like this. So you can get into whichever way is more comfortable for you. I'm gonna do the way where my legs are out. So go ahead and get in that position right now. Forehead is touching the mat. Your arms are down, touching the mat. And we're gonna breathe in. And then slowly back out. Breathe back in. And then back out. Breathe back in. And then back out. Slowly come up. Slowly just bring your body back up. Let's just come back and face the center of your mat. Well, thank you friends for joining me today on Get Your Play Online. I just really enjoyed doing yoga with you. Um, I hope that you have a great day. Bye.